Okay, in today's travel video, we are here at K-Pop Anime. K-Pop in USA, I think, is an actual term for this particular store. And we're going to see what it has to offer. Um, from what I've seen online, it's one of the biggest anime shops here in Orlando. Um, now, I will be transparent here and say I don't really know a whole lot about anime. I'm taking my daughter here, but I figured while we're here, I might as well film it. Maybe show you guys what this place is. Uh, is like and hopefully it'll help somebody on the internet so let's check it out okay as soon as you walk in the door they got these extra large anime tapestries for 40 bucks and then they got these kind of medium size and large size acrylic posters All right, this is just a lay of the land of what, how sprawling this store is. They got a pretty large space here. All kinds of keychains and lanyards. K-pop posters, they got Groups are $3.99, solos are $5.99. Hopefully this uh, video doesn't get demonetized because of the music, but... So if you do hear any kind of weird music that comes on here, it doesn't really match. The video it's because i had to overlay music all right take a look at this this is some stickers This one here says Pink Christmas. Not sure what those things are there, but they light up. Some plushes here. We hear some of the apparel that they have. $25 for that shirt. All right, over here we have some hats. Three hundred and sixty five seventeen days. A pop up stand. Some Hello Kitty merchandise. That's pretty popular. And then all kinds of plushes here. Alright, they're right here behind me. They got all kinds of stuffed animals and plushes. Let's walk over here. It looks like they got some pretty cool looking figurines. Oh wait, before we pass this by, I'll show you this. All right, let's take a look at these figurines. Looks like they range from $20 to $25. I hear some $10 figurines. All kinds of different characters. I hear 
there's some guys up here. There's our 20 to 25 also. And then these are a little bit larger size, so they do have a higher price tag on them. $50, $60. And some forty dollar. Okay, here are some more figurines, but before we dive into those, let me show you some of the tapestries that they have here. Alright, take a look at these figurines. Those are $70 figurines right there. There's some $20 ones. I'll be honest, I don't know the name of any of these. So if you have a favorite on here, maybe you can comment down below see if anybody else can chime in and relate to your particular fandom actually I do know that guy back there maybe Todoroki or possibly from my hero academia there's some more That one back there in the very back, that girl, she's seventy dollars. This like tiger half tiger half man is about seventy dollars also. All kinds of cool figures. Said so that these were originally seventy five dollars and they're running on sale for fifty dollars on some of these figures or well, somebody could rack up some dollars if they really want to and getting a collection built up with some of these and take a look at the detail on these Keep on going through here. All right, they have some of these in a special case, I'm assuming, because these are more valuable. That one's $300. There's some larger scale ones on the bottom. $460 on that one there. Some of these um, figures are very risque looking. They should put ratings on these figures. I think I'm out of the uh, G rating here. Maybe even beyond the PG. <laughs> All right, here's some jewelry. All in these cases here, they got all kinds of trinkets and jewelry. And over here, more figurines. Wow, this is the most I've ever seen it as far as an anime shop goes. A large collection. So this particular store, from what I gather, was in a smaller, a smaller space, and they actually moved here to this space because um, they could display more items. Look at that. I definitely filled up the space. All right, let's look at some of these items that are in the display case here. You got some buttons that range anywhere from $6 to $20. These are keychains. And they also range from $10 to $15. And here's some buttons. Uh, 
Let's take a look and see what's in these cases here. We got some more buttons. It says, please do not open cases. Please take a picture and show it at the register. Take a look on uh, that wall. They got these pretty cool looking banners that are displayed all the way around the store. Vertical banners. Okay, these cases look like they're very similar to the ones that we just passed. They have a lot of buttons and keychains. Right here are some little baggies. All right, you got more plushes here. Looks like they got some Mario, Super Mario Brothers over there. Okay, over here, it looks like um, Star Wars figure here in the anime section. $190 for that Mandalorian figure. They got some Dark Maul down there. That's a little bit more my speed. And some more figures. All right, I got some tumblers over there. More figures. Oh, look at that big old k pop and sign USA. They haven't put that up on the building. They're still still working on this space and making it their own. But there's a uh, vending machines over there where you can try and win something because they're the claw vending machines. Um, all right, gives you a look at what k pop and USA is here in Orlando. Hopefully this gave you guys a better idea of what to expect if you're in the market to buy some anime merch and check this place out. Thanks for watching.